was a Sunday night, and Ebenezer Children's Home called us and said we had two girls. Would we take them? I said yes. They said for me to ask her. And, and then when we got there, um, I walk in. Uh, now mind you, the house where they were living was about 26 degrees. That's how cold it was outside, and that's how cold it was inside. They had no heat. They had not been bathed in, I think it was about a month, that they could tell. They had the same clothes on, same underwear, same socks for about a month. So they went back for six months, and then it just got to be where um, it was, um, they, they just couldn't do it. It was January 2014, and the parents called me. He was in a panic, and he said, uh, Mr. Bradford, will you take my kids? And I said, yes, but you can't give me that authority. It has to be through the state. I mean, it was seconds later, uh, Ebenezer Children's Home called me, and they said, you're not gonna believe this. And I said, they just lost the kids. So I went and got her from the house, and we left, and DSS called us on the way there and um, said, the girls don't believe that that you're coming. And I said, well, yeah. We're there. And they said, well, we need for you to talk to them on the phone so they could hear her and me. And I said, hey, we're coming to get you. We're almost there. And then that's when they started singing Jesus Loves Me. And so I, you know, when they came in, I said, hey, little girls, how you doing? And then when Kath came around the corner, that's when they came running and, uh, you know, saying, you came, you came, you came. So it was a, it was a pretty uh, emotional moment. So when we brought these girls in, they were singing, I'm a child of God, yes I am. And uh, I mean, it was beautiful. And I just sat there and I thought, you know, this is what it's about.